Let's have a look, shall we? Now that is an entrance. Taskmaster. We need to get that detonator. That bomb goes off, it could liquefy everything within a ten mile radius. Well, what are we waiting for? Saw that coming, huh? You think you've won? What the hell are you talking about? Look around, Romanov. The world will remember this day. The day their heroes failed them. <laughs> What's happening here? The city's collapsing. Us. Steve, can you hear me? Get the hell out of there! Beta. Screw this. ago, the Avengers paraded dangerous, untested technology causing damage on an unprecedented scale. Our beloved Captain America was killed during the attempted theft of this technology. Thousands of other innocent people died, and many more still bear the scars of what has come to be known as A-Day. Hundreds fell sick, encased in strange cocoons, only to emerge with dangerous, otherworldly powers. With no known cure, the disease has spread across the country, and while both S.H.I.E.L.D. and the Avengers promised to rectify the situation, it was Dr. Banner's testimony that brought about the end of an era. You so-called heroes transformed San Francisco into an infectious, gas-filled quarantine zone.
You unleash diseased, powerful beings that wreak havoc throughout our nation. Many still lay dormant, unidentified. So I ask you again, Dr. Banner, do the Avengers pose a danger to society? Yes. Their activities outlawed, the once mighty heroes disbanded. But out of tragedy is born hope. After the government liquidation of Stark Industries, Dr. George Tarleton, himself a victim of A-Day and founder of Advanced Idea Mechanics, thinks science is the solution to our nation's problems. I wish I knew what happened to Captain Rogers that day, but I was nowhere near the reactor room. I don't have those answers, but I can promise you this. I will use this second chance to make you safe. AIM will find a cure for the inhuman disease. Comforting words to those families torn apart by the disease. But is he too confident? Many criticize AIM's tactics. This so-called resistance army grows stronger every day. This is Phil Sheldon reporting live at the A-Day anniversary. I can't see the revolution right under their noses. Come on. Where'd you guys go? There's gotta be a clue here somewhere. Hello there. If you get it right, copy everything. We'll find you. Now we're talking. Whoa, Retro Stark. Do you have a moment to talk, Beta? Uh, yeah, uh, sure. The girls are leaving for the mosque retreat in a couple of hours. It's still not too late to meet them at the bus. It was tonight? Kamala, we talked about this. Going to the retreat will be a good time to get away from all of this. Breathe some fresh air, laugh. Nakia will be very disappointed if you don't go. You're right. I'll think about it. Good. Very good. There'll be ice cream, eh? <laughs> oh, and best of all, no boys, so lots of fun. <laughs> I love you, Beta. I love you more. But you don't get it. Okay. Where were we? Password hint. First love. Hmm. Oh. Oh my god, I'm in! I'm in! I can't believe it! Oh, right. Uh, copy everything. Bless your inflated ego, Tony Stark. <laughs> I really kicked the hornet's nest. 
Gotta get to headquarters and check out what's on this flash drive. Alright, see what we've got. The Chimera? This must be the reactor room security footage. Dr. Tarleton? But you're supposed to be on the command deck. Oh, Cap. What's going on? No way. Tarleton sealed him in? There's no malfunction. He killed Cap. Oh my god, he killed Cap! What? Tiny Dancer? Oh no. Heroes Park? Hmm. I, I don't know. This could be a trap. But what if it isn't? Someone needs to see this. Just be smart, Kamala. Hand over the proof, and you're done. Ugh. Tiny dancer? Hey, hey, where are you going? Uh, home. Really? We just got here. Hey, want a drink? Nah, no thanks. What? Are you paying your respects? I'm just taking a shortcut, that's all, fellas. <laughs> shortcut. Come on, get out of there. Right. Cool lighter. So you want him back, huh? So they can kill more of us? What? No. No? No? No. What is it then? Hmm? And you must get you going? <gasps> Come on, fellas. Stupid sympathizers. Stop! Are you okay? <laughs> Candle Kid's got a girlfriend. Zach, check out her bag. What? What the hell is wrong with you people? I just want to go home, okay, man? <gasps> what are you doing? My kid brother was there on A-Day. He wrote some dumb stuff about Captain America. It wasn't Cap's fault. It's all their fault. He turned all freakish and purple. And then they took him away. <gasps> hey, take it easy. Zach, enough, and now he's dude. Dead. Stop! He's dead! I said stop! stop. 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 Get back. <gasps> She's one of them! Oh. Don't let her touch you. We gotta go. Dude. Are you okay? Come on, let's go. Don't touch me. What? Um, you're a tiny dancer, right? What do I do with this? What are you talking about? Please, just let me go. <laughs> Still a liability. Uh, no, 
good. You're awake. I'm so sorry. Those synthoids were only following their security protocols. Stealing private information is a serious offense. Monica, give her a moment. Hey, what's going on? Where are you people taking me? Somewhere safe. Uh, forgive me. <laughs> I know I don't quite compare to my holographic counterpart. But it's a nice trick for the shareholders. <laughs> Dr. Tarleton? In the flesh. Why did you hack our servers? I didn't steal anything. And what were you looking for? The cure, perhaps? Kamala, AIM only wants to free us from being at the mercy of the powerful. You know, subjectivity. Unlimited power, that's dangerous. It's lethal. A-Day was a prime example. You are lucky to be alive. But with technology, we can right their wrongs. We can give you back your normal life. Look, I, I just guessed a password, okay? I, I didn't think I'd actually get in. She is clearly violent. Her infection must be getting worse. What? I, I didn't mean to hurt anyone. Of course not. But what happens when you lose control again? Hmm? What happens when you hurt someone that you love? Even the Avengers had to suffer for their hubris. Hey, were you there? I mean, when Cap died. Were you there? Yes. Luckily, Monica found me on the command deck. Her regenerative formula saved my life. Come on, Kamala. Let's do this. Yes? Let AIM help you. I'll take my chances. Damn it, George! Get the girl! Now! Well done, Kamala. You just outed yourself as an inhuman. Stupid! What were you thinking, huh? Join the resistance? Become some kind of hero? I can't go home. I'll make Abu. They'll punish them for hiding me. We messed up. Utah. The old shield base. The resistance has to know what to do. Subject 1102 can clone herself almost perfectly, with the exception of a slight color variation in the eyes. The cells are splitting down the center, creating two separate individuals. Oh, it's, it's like the planarian flatworm, only human. Exactly. And can retain all the memories of the original subject. 0925 can create powerful bursts of energy, and, and there's at least a half a dozen with fire based abilities. We're building an arsenal. Programmable power under our control. No more heroes, no more mistakes. It's time for another dose. I feel fine. 
You were in a coma for six months. Earlier, you could barely contain your cough. A few more doses of my regenerative formula, and your treatment will be complete. They still light candles at the base of that statue. If not for that hammer, I'd have torn the thing down. Leave it. Why have the public thinking you're still worried about the Avengers? Let my people handle it. We have a daptoid to launch. You're right. This version may be a bit more... potent. Is it stabilized? Almost. Incredible! You have reached Yusuf Khan. Please, leave a message and I will return your call. Hey, Abu. So, I took your advice. I'm with Nakia and the others on the retreat. Can you believe there's no cell service out here? I, I had to hike all the way up to this payphone to make this phone call. Anyway, um, you're right. We're having a blast. I'll, I'll be home late Sunday. Promise I'll be good. Love you more. Deck. Oh. How is this still here? Terrigen was powerful stuff. Who's there?
gotta get out of here. There's my way out. No sign of the resistance anywhere. Hulk must have scared him away. Better find a way off this thing. What am I supposed to do with this footage now? Just making sure that you don't die on me. Okay. You can't Maybe. just go around drawing people's blood. I, I, I know, I know. Under normal circumstances, no. But these aren't normal circumstances. Holy crap. Dr. Banner? Oh, no. Um... Highway 9, Highway 9, it's about 20 miles to Highway 9. If you take Highway 9, you can go to the then you probably could just do s what sorry. What are you talking about? I've spent a lot of time, um, as the, as the big guy, so. How long have you been here? Uh, a, a few years, yeah. Uh, That's remarkable. Yeah, so I've been told. So, this is why aimbots chase a kid into the desert? Not exactly. I kind of stole something off of AIM's server. Huh? <laughs> what? Why? Uh, Why? I know, I know, I know, okay? I, I just, I think you should see for yourself. It's Tarleton. Yeah. Why are you shutting down the security protocols? Did, did he just... Right? Right? That's what I thought. He totally locked the cap in the reactor room and then he tried to jack the chimera. That's a bit of a stretch. We know that the reactor was malfunctioning, so it's possible Cap asked him to shut down the security protocols and then lock the no, door. No, we've heard the A-Day testimony tons of times. Tarleton and Monica were on the command deck when the explosion happened, and that's why they barely survived. But this proves that Tarleton was nowhere near the command deck when the explosion happened. This proves he was lying. So... Where's the rest of it? it? Got bumped off. The rest of the footage got corrupted. Yeah. Look. What if the Avengers were set up? Okay. Tarleton, aim. The so called cure? It's just not lining up. There's something wrong, and I can feel it. Don't you? I thought you were just some nosy little thief trying to make off a cap shield. <laughs> so? I was thinking. Couldn't Mr. Stark help us with this? 
I mean, the whole mainframe was built on his technology. Yeah. If anyone could get us in, it could be him, right? Yeah. There is a bus stop off Highway 9. You're gonna keep heading west, and then when you do, we'll take you to some old friends who can help. Maria's good people. Tell her I sent you, and uh, just show her all of this. But you saw the video. You I'm know something's not right sorry. here. sorry. I can't help you. I wish I could, but I can't. But you're Dr. Bruce Banner. You're one of the greatest minds of our time. Greatest minds? Look at you. Look at what we did. You have no idea how dangerous it is. Carlton calls people like me inhuman. He claims we're sick, violent, demented. He says our disease will kill us in the end. Well, I don't believe it. Guess I'll find Mr. Stark myself. Wait, just... You'll need a ride. Really? Tony stashed most of his stuff here when Stark Industries went under. And if anyone knows where Tony is, it's Jarvis. This trail should take us to the Archive's secret entrance. Cool. Well, it's a nice day for a hike. Finally. This means we're close. Oh, wait. <clears throat> As well it should. Got him. Send in containment units. Dr. Banner, what do I do? Run. What? good? Okay. We're cool. I guess. Oh, man. AIM didn't just arrive. They've set up shop. We've got to find Jarvis and get out of here. Guess AIM took over the place. Still think Mr. Stark's here? I could head through the vents and take a look. Yeah, that works. You made it! They were keeping the humans in here. What happened? This is where they hurt them. Hulk. 
I need you to destroy this lab. Smash! Restrain the Hulk! You saw the truth, Banner. You were the only one. Sharp guys. Now to find Hulk and get out of here. What you got there, Cricket? Why don't you let me have that? I don't think so. Disappointing. Is it... dead? Hey, where are we anyway? Right, I'm talking to myself. Okay. Show 
Tell me your secrets. K705. <laughs> According to our lead scientist, we have successfully reverse engineered Terrigen gas. What? Wait, please. Calm down. In a moment, this will all be over. Administer the cure. What, what does that mean? You're hurting him. Please. Please, please stop. Where am I? A promising result. Case 705 has made a remarkable recovery and will be monitored for the next 24 hours. Congratulations. You've been cured. Impossible. We should get out of here. It isn't safe. Yeah. Sure. Well, you can feel free to make it a little more homey. Oh, thanks. Yeah. You good? I'm not used to you being this quiet. Uh, uh yeah, it's nothing. Okay. Okay. Good. So, yeah. What if it's real? Oh, sorry, what was that? Uh, the cure. What if it's real? I mean, I mean, it looks real, but uh, what if I could be normal again? <laughs> it, uh, it didn't work like that. I mean, you saw them. It looks like it really hurts, but. Maybe that's worth it? Kamala... I never really fit in before. I mean, uh, superheroes were my world, and I figured if I could just... Uh, if I could just win that fan fiction competition, you know, then everything would just be... It doesn't matter. <laughs> now look at me. I'm a freak. Whoa, you're not a... <sighs> What you did back there? Hey. What you did back there took a lot of guts. S stupid. <laughs> but it still took guts. And... Not a lot of people could, you know, do that. Good isn't a thing you are. What? It, it's nothing. Um, thank you. This room is really great. Okay. Or it will be. I mean, okay. look at it. Yeah, <laughs> it's out of fun. Um, good. Yeah, thanks. Okay, I'll go do other things. Good job, Kamala. That wasn't awkward at all. But now I have my own room on the Chimera. Okay, here goes nothing. Good afternoon, Dr. Banner. Oh. Whoa. We did it. Tony Stark's super awesome computer pal. Oh, I'm just a rather very intelligent system. A pleasure to meet you, miss. <laughs> Con. <laughs> But you can call me Kamala. A pleasure, Miss Kamala. What's going on? The war table isn't getting enough power. The system is on emergency lockdown. Hmm. Looks like I tripped the security sensors when I was in the lab. We'll have to disable them. I got this. 
Nice work, Kamala. Okay, Jarvis, let's find Tony. Uh, Jarvis? Searching now. Hold on, something... Something is wrong, Dr. Banner. That's not good. Oh, dear. It appears my neural uplink was damaged when the Chimera crashed. It's highly specific shield technology. Without it, I can't access the global database. Shield? Uh, let's get Maria on the phone. Maria Hill? Is she leading S.H.I.E.L.D. now? Uh, sort of. No one knows what happened to Director Fury, so Hill is the only one I know I can trust. Bruce, it's, uh, it's good to see you. After my run-in with the Hulk, I wasn't sure we'd be hearing from you again. Yeah, sorry about all that. Uh, Hulk's been having some issues. You don't have to apologize. All our lives fell apart after that day. I'm just glad to see the Avengers back in action. Well, not quite. Hi, Kamala Khan. It's just the two of us for now. We're trying to find Mr. Stark. Yeah, uh, Marie, we're gonna need a neural uplink. You gotta have one stored somewhere. All of our resources were seized by AIM, and most agents are still in hiding. But I may know where to look. I'm sending the coordinates to your war table. I can brief you on the way. Shall I prep the Quinjet's engine, sir? Uh, what Quinjet? Did you know this was here the entire time? <laughs> Absolutely not. I swear. Uh-huh. I think you just wanted to go on a road trip in your RV. <laughs> no. 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 I'm giving you access to S.H.I.E.L.D. secure frequency. It should lead you to the bunker. Hang on. I'm getting some interference. Something down there is blocking the track. See if you can find out what. On it. I believe we may have triggered a classified shield security system. Avenger detected. Hello, Avengers. It's been a while. Nick Fury! If you're hearing this, then the worst has happened. I'm gone. And that means I need you now more than ever. I always knew shield might fall. So I made sure it could also rise again. These are the S.H.I.E.L.D. protocols. S.H.I.E.L.D. was built to protect the world. In times like this, when it all seems hopeless, that's when we've got to stand strong. So I need a favor. Deliver these protocols to any remaining subdirector. They'll give S.H.I.E.L.D. what they need to rebuild. Good luck, Avengers. Fury out. Now that the neural uplink has been successfully installed, I can access my full database. Director Hill is reviewing the S.H.I.E.L.D. protocols that you also recovered. Feeling better, Jarvis? Everything seems to be in working order. You have no idea how much this means to me. To S.H.I.E.L.D. Thank you, Bruce. You too, Kamala. With this, I can start rebuilding S.H.I.E.L.D. in earnest. If you ever need anything, give me a call. I'm sure we'll be seeing a lot more of each other. Looking forward to it, Director. I feel like I should salute or something. No, no need for that. Good luck, both of you. Jarvis, you think you can get us Tony? This will take some time, but I should be able to find Mr. Stark. In the meantime, I've uncovered something that might be of interest to Miss Khan in the harm room. The what now? The holographic augmented reality machine. Something the Avengers use for training. Whoa, that sounds awesome. Mr. Stark's last known location is his ancestral home, Golden Acres. You may be able to find a clue to his current whereabouts there. Ever heard of it? He really does not want to be found. Indeed not. The estate was located in a remote area of Nevada. I can provide you with the precise coordinates. Check out the fancy drawbridge. Uh, typical. Subtle Tony. 
after you. And hello, Golden Acres! Ah. This can't be it. Let's get this over with. So Tony Stark... The Tony Stark lives here? I appear so. Tony? Hey, Bruce. Long night? Ooh, long five years. <laughs> um, at least it's quiet. Yeah. It was. I... <sighs> hey, back off! Hi, I'm sorry. Who are you? Uh, Kamala? Well, uh, Kamala, your Emeraldite friend here is kind of on my shit list. Okay. I deserve it. Yeah, you're damn right you deserved it. Do the Avengers pose a danger to society? That was the question, Bruce. That was the question. Did you even check the science? It was, it was a heist, sense? Bruce. No. We were outsmarted. No. The Terrigen reactor was unstable, oh, and you knew that, you knew that, and you still paraded it before the entire world. So what? We just give up? We didn't give up, Tony. We failed. At least I can admit that. No. No, we failed him. We failed him. Tony, I don't know how long you're going to be mad at me, and to be honest with you, I don't really care. Take as long as you want. But, but the kid is inhuman. We did this. And she needs your help. I, I can't. I can't. You can't what? You're ditching me? Hey, don't take it personally, kid. No, this is what he does, isn't it? And why don't you take a good look around, huh? I can barely help myself. <laughs> this was a mistake. Now we agree on something. So you're both just gonna walk away? The Avengers were set up. Cap was murdered. You think I don't know that? Huh? I've replayed that day in my head a thousand times. The Avengers take the ball despite saving the day, and that bastard Charlton walks away smelling like a rose. And guess what? Guess what? No one cares. No one cares. The world needed someone to blame, and he gave them their scapegoat. So, Unless you have some kind of astounding proof. I suggest you both get off my land. What is that? Proof. This better be good. Hmm. Kind of buried the lead, you know. Could have told me about that earlier. No, no, no. No sitting on my couch. You're still on the list. Where did you get this? Guess your password on some resistance blog. Impressive. Dude, your password was I am Iron Man. Really? Huh. Thought I'd change that. Son of a bitch. I know, it's incomplete. There's a whole folder on AIM's server. No, no, there's there's more here. What? Yeah, look at smart. They encrypted it to look like a corrupt file. Need a few hours, I'll get all the rest. What is this? Who is who is Tiny Dancer? Oh no. We gotta get out of here. What? You know this shameless Elton John fan? They helped me get out of Jersey. I wouldn't be here if they hadn't warned me about AIM. Really? Tiny Dancer? Look, we really should go. Now. 
I would have gone with Rocket Man. Okay. I gotta get dressed. You have a suit? Yeah. Maybe, sorta. Of. We'll see. Excuse me while I slip into something less comfortable. where I left my boots. Ah, of course, Bruce tries to saddle me with a stray fangirl. After all these years, he's still... No, son of a... Well, looks like Tiny Dancer was telling the truth. machine. Still a thing of beauty. Can't say the same about her. More party crashers. here somewhere. Good thing I don't have neighbors. I'd be so pissed off right now. You always love to make an entrance, Stark. How did I do? Uh, I'll give you a 7 out of 10. Good to see you, Georgie boy. Been working out? Really any other billion dollar companies lately? Just yours. Hey! You're gonna pay for that window, Tarleton! You need to listen to logic and reason. Why start now? Wait! No! The stuff was in there! How are you feeling? I've never felt better. Your synthetics were useless. If you'd let me deal with the Hulk and Khan earlier, the Archive would still be standing. Watch your words. You no longer make the rules. He does. When I was young, I found an orphaned wolf cub in the forest behind our farm. What? Dad said it was too dangerous. He told me to get rid of it. I fed that cub. I named him. I watched him play with my beloved dog, Darwin. You're wasting my time. I felt if I could instill rules, the proper boundaries, I could harness the raw power of that beast. Have you done rambling? Oh, oh. A few months later, while hunting, the adolescent cub turned on me, snarling, frothing at the mouth. Darwin bought me a few precious moments to call for help. My dad shot the wolf, but it was too late. Darwin had been torn to pieces. We need him. I I'm sorry. I don't know what came over me. Leave. Please. Jarvis! You haven't aged a day. Welcome back, Mr. Stark. Missed you, buddy. You flying free? In full working order. Give me the worst of it. The Chimera is running on secondary power. Major hull damage is also detected. Engines are offline. 
Climate. So it's bad. That is an accurate assessment. Okay, we gotta get this bird airborne. <laughs> Excuse me? AIM knows it's here. So it needs to not be here when they get here. What? All right. While we work on cleanup, you mind taking a look at something for me? Certainly, sir. See what you can do about decrypting this file. At once. I think I found the problem. I just... Oh! It's definitely the initiator cores. Wait, don't the bigger aimbots use similar cores? If we could get a hold of one, I could get this old bird in the air in no time. Indeed, sir. But someone would need to procure said initiator cores. Yeah, I barely have a suit. Maybe I could cobble something together. I'll search inventory for leftover pieces of armor. Whoa. <gasps> hey! Sorry? You should've knocked. I was trying, uh, as knocking fist. Jarvis, help me out here. It appears the locking mechanisms on some of the Chimera's crew quarters have not been enabled. There you have it. I will fix that. Please do. I'm gonna meet up on the command deck in about ten minutes. You should, uh, should come. I know, I... I look ridiculous. <laughs> yeah. Of course you do. Man... No, 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 we all do. It's part of the job. Have you seen Thor's outfit? Flowing robe? Vegas shoulder pads? Pretty ridiculous. <laughs> I am digging this, uh... Oh, it's a burkini. My mom bought it for me. Muslim ladies like to wear it for sports and stuff. It's great. Oh. All right, I'm just gonna change. Wait, 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 wait. The outfit is... is all about attitude. You gotta wear it like you mean it. Show me what you got. Come on, you can do better than that. Yeah, now we're talking? All right. You know what? Maybe I can help you with some upgrades for that. Gear's already spinning. Really? Yeah. Oh, and if Bruce says anything, just... remind him that all he wears are super stretchy shorts. <laughs> Bruce, the kid's fine. She's tough. Kinda like her. And she laughs at my jokes. Yeah, she, uh, she grows on you. Hey, uh, meet me at the tech lab. I've almost got this door fixed. You got it, stretchy thing. Sorry, what was that? Nothing. On my way. You're still working on this door, huh? Well, I just need to remove the entire junction box and reconnect the... Ah! Great job, buddy. See? Wasn't so hard. Home sweet home. All right, if we're gonna get anywhere, we'll need to establish an alternate power source. Chimera was built for Terrigen, but I can convert it to run on something a little less... explody. I'm scanning the region for sources, but it'll take some time to identify potential initiator core heat signatures. Well, in the meantime, I need a new suit. Where can I find parts to repair the fabrication unit? I've located a good salvage spot and have sent the coordinates to the war table, when you're ready. War table, got it. Fix the fabrication unit, get a shiny new suit, and get this bird off the ground. I'll upload the dropship's last known location to your HUD. The canyon walls prevent me from fully confirming the intel. I suggest you work quickly. Well, not exactly rocking a state-of-the-art suit, but it should get me there in one piece. Two, max. Where the hell is my dropship? Scanning. The dropship was moved to a more secure location ahead. We can't get there before it takes off. We can if we overcharge the suit by 300% and take the direct route. Sir, you might literally explode, and that canyon is treacherous. Sure, but I feel the need for speed. Do it, Goose, and play something fast. The dropship shielded. Use all the juice left in the suit to get an EMP burst ready for me to trigger. Jarvis, 
Yes, sir. I've scanned the dropship and it contains the needed parts to repair the Chimera's fabrication machine. Excellent. Let's check in on the kids and head home. Well, that was fun. Gotta say, it's nice to be back in the saddle. Yes, sir. You haven't missed a beat. Ah, glad to see that flattery upgrade kicked in. Now, let's take a peek at our loot. Ah, we hit the jackpot, buddy. This is exactly what I need to fix the fabrication machine. Glad to hear it. Especially as your current suit is now... How do you put it? Kaput. Hey, hey. Did the job, right? All right. Now that is more like it. Don't it look amazing, Jarvis? Take my picture. Well done, sir. All right, guys, we've got work to do. Nice suit. Touche. How can we help? Jarvis has found a couple heat signatures that might be concentrations of initiator cores, but they're in completely separate locations. Since time is of the essence, we're going to need to hit both locations simultaneously. Bruce, you and Kamala need to search the outskirts of the Badlands while I investigate a city on the eastern seaboard. Hopefully one of these spots yield us those initiator cores. You got it. Whoa, 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 whoa. Where is everyone? Seems AIM has evacuated the city due to heavy inhuman activity. Sounds like an excuse to experiment on dangerous technology. Maybe your heat signature hunch was right. A giant stash of initiator cores could power their experiments. The facility is heavily guarded. Expect resistance upon your arrival. You mean they won't be happy to see me? Shocking. Oh no. Not good, not good at all. This is my arc reactor technology, but supersized. This could level cities. What is AIM thinking? Oh. Hello there, handsome. Sir, the reactors are becoming increasingly unstable. You must shut it down. Congratulations, sir. You've successfully destroyed the arc reactor. Well, that's not something I ever expected to hear you say. Let's salvage what we can and get out of here. Are you all right? Yeah. Yeah, just... You know, I made it for all the right reasons. That's what I told myself. But look at what happened. The Terrigen Reactor, A-Day. Now this... I can't control what other people do with my tech, but I can't pretend it's out of my hands anymore. I'm proud of you, sir. Yeah. I'm proud of me, too. Speaking of trouble, Bruce, Kamala, any luck with those initiator cores? Uh... Working on it. Okay, kids. I'm counting on you finding this second heat signature. Hopefully it yields us a bounty of initiator cores. It won't be long till AIM pinpoints the location of the Chimera, and without a base of operations... Yeah, well, we won't have much of a chance. So, don't let me down. And good luck. That's... a lot of pressure. Target spotted! That's the Hulk! We need backup out here! <sighs> we have scavenged. Every part of this desert by now, and it's not going to be enough. <sighs> Am I alone? What? Where are all the other Inhumans? Why aren't they fighting back? I... I... I've seen the Resistance symbols, I've heard rumors of a rebellion, but still nothing? I don't feel sick at all. 
I've never felt more alive. What if I'm wrong? I know what that feels like. These powers are a part of us. And all I do know, it's a lot better if you just embrace that. Or something like that. My dad used to say the same thing. Well, he's a smart guy. <laughs> the best. You should head back to the Chimera. Okay. Stay where you are! Come on, man. A uh, kid and an old guy. Old guy. All right. Dr. Pym will see you now. Do H Hank Pym? Could ask you the same thing. <laughs> <laughs> oh, it's good to see you, man. Good to see you. Uh, Kamala, this is Dr. Hank Pym. Ant Man? That was uh, another life. Follow me. Okay, so this is the heat signature we've been searching for. We have been salvaging weapons, robots, aim tech, anything we can to build up our defenses. Think you could spare some of these initiator cores? You know, help out a helicarrier in need of some TLC? I imagine we can make some arrangements. Thank you very much. What <laughs> is this place? We call it the Ant Hill. Oh. Not my idea. I think it was one of our anonymous hackers, Tiny Dancer. No way. So, so they're all... Inhumans, yes. Many of them were prisoners at a name facility. I guess they were fighting back after all. Make yourself at home. We've got lots to catch up on. Okay, now that we've got some muscle on our side, I think we should hit one of Ames' testing labs. We know they've been experimenting on inhumans in small rural communities. I'd like to get my hands on whatever research they've been collecting. Sounds good. We crashed one of their big labs in the Pacific Northwest. Olympia Archive? Impressive. We wondered who was responsible for taking that place down. Thanks. We didn't get out with a lot of information, but now maybe we can find out more. Welcome to Venture Ridge, Wyoming. This was one of Ames' go-to holding sites for inhumans before the prison was built. After they moved in, most of the residents were evacuated. Got it. Keep an eye out for AIM patrols. They won't take kindly to your presence. With any luck, we'll be able to capture intel that could shed some light on what they've been doing to your people. Looks like we made it just in time. Get close to those terminals so I can infiltrate their network. We must control all three to override the transport's navigation systems. Be on guard. AIM will try to regain control of the terminals. Taking off! Jarvis, tell me you got it. Yes, sir. With point four seconds to spare. The transport should be arriving at the anthill within the hour. Excellent work, everyone. Head back here and we'll begin digging through those AIM research samples. Cool, 
powers. Oh. I mean, <laughs> they look awesome. Um, I'm a polymorph, I think. It's cool, it's like, like stretchy arms and stuff. Uh, still working on making it not look goofy, but... You're inhuman. Yeah. So what's your name? Dante. Kamala. Hey, what happened? I broke my leg during the escape. Well, at least you made it out, right? My mom came back for me. Yeah. And she was captured. Well, the Avengers are on the way here in a couple days, okay? They're gonna take back the prison and your mom's gonna be fine, A couple believe days? Me. Why isn't anyone listening to me? I overheard Dr. Pym. They're moving all the prisoners to a new location. Well, uh, they'll find that too. God, no, they won't. Your Avengers will be too late. Here, let me help uh, you. No. Don't you get it? We're inhuman. No one cares about us. I've got to tell Bruce. We could do something. I've got to convince Bruce and Dr. Pym to go back to the prison. Roy, I need you to send one of your disposable chassis to the Camaro with a few supplies. And Roy, stealth will be key. Right away, Doctor. I'm gonna say it. It's, it's just genius. Hey, you got a sec? Yeah, 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 what's up? Aim's moving the Inhumans to a more secure location. Soon. Okay. You've been talking to Dante? Uh, I'm sorry, who, who's Dante? One of our Inhuman survivors. We were able to get him out, but his mother is still inside. And our escape caused AIM to shore up security. Gotcha. Look, we have to help them. That's not a good idea. What? There's inhumans in there. I don't understand. Dante's wait, mom. Wait. We can't I, no, just no, sit no, around I, and I, do I, nothing. We're not going to sit around and do nothing, okay? Roy just left with the energy cores. It means Tony's going to be here in less than a day. We need to wait. I don't understand. We have the Hulk. Mama. The Resistance has been trying to infiltrate that facility for months. Getting out was far easier than getting in, and we, we had help. From the ground, its walls are nearly impenetrable. You saw what we did back there. I could help. But it's too risky. You want to help? You don't There's understand. You're not inhuman. You're not ready. I'm sorry. We wait. Sorry, I can't just... I can't do nothing. Hey, Kamala. You still up this late? Yeah, I... was going to lie, but I'm going to the prison. They wouldn't be moving those prisoners if it wasn't for us. Respect. Right this way. Really? Just like that? I've got a good feeling about you. But you're gonna need this. It's not safe out there. Thanks, Theo. Those inhumans need our help. Uh -oh. Okay, Kamala, this is the real deal. Just keep it together.
Get these open, and I'm in. Can we just pretend you never saw me? Enemy spotted. terms of our agreement were clear. We deliver a cure. You control the media. And we more than held up our end, but this cure of yours? Children being ripped away from their families? People missing? <laughs> Even my resources have their limits. The public needs answers. I'm giving you something better. The launch of the Adaptoids will be the perfect distraction. <clears throat> and after? Without proof that your cure works, words like terrorism are being bandied about in some of my circles. Oh, it will work, Senator. I have the utmost confidence in Dr. Rappuccini's abilities. How much of that was a lie? The effect of the gas is still only temporary. And without my formula to keep them alive, well, the gas... Kills them. This isn't working! That gas gave us the Adaptoid. My formula kept you alive. Now if I could isolate how it manifests within the Inhumans, I know I can reverse the effects. There are more opportunities here! We have enough powers harvested to build your army. It's time we cut our losses. Shut it down. Adaptoids. I've only seen these things on paper. Damn it! That better not be the girl, Monica. Gotta get in there. What the hell are you thinking, kid? You should have stayed put. Where are you? Dark Jerichen. None of your so-called cures ever work, Monica. You're provoking her powers. It's killing her. You're not even looking for a cure anymore. Keeps in humans alive just long enough to copy their powers. It's just a cover for your twisted experiments. Stealing powers to create adaptoids. I have to find Kamala. All right.
hoping I'd meet you. Gotcha! Tiny Dancer doesn't have as much bite as Black Widow, does it? Took you long enough to figure it out. I thought you were the brains behind this operation. I am. It's nice to be appreciated. Nice suit. You've caused me enough problems. And I'm not done yet. Where's the girl, Monica? Huh. Oh, not so easy as that. Where are you taking the inhuman? Somewhere safe. You can have all my toys. Of course, people are toys to you. No, not toys. Noble sacrifices for the greater good! Bad guy Bingo! Are you twisting your mustache inside that suit? Mock me. But everything I've done has been for the future of humankind. Your prisoners are human too, Monica. Collateral damage is inevitable! You should know this better than most! I've heard that argument before. Always ends with people dying. Done everything with you. What does that mean to me? I haven't forgotten Aiden. Neither have I. The Avengers have done enough damage, cost enough lives. The world saw that on A Day. We don't need you anymore. As long as you're keeping people in cages, I'm not going anywhere. <laughs> Did you move the Inhumans? Wouldn't you like to know? Damn it. You won't get off that easy. I've got a special guest here. Binder. She's coming with us. Have you seen a teenage girl? Brown hair about yay high? Uh, yeah. Uh, yeah, yeah, in the in the cells. Um, she wouldn't come with us, though. Okay, just go. Kamala. Black Widow? What, what are you doing? Come on. Let's get out of here. Uh... I'm going home. Uh, to Jersey. Um, I don't know who I was kidding. I'm no hero. I don't know. I got a quinjet full of people who would disagree with you. I couldn't control it. I. I keep passing out. I. I blew it. Hey. 
Mistakes are gonna happen. To be honest, Jersey wasn't my finest hour either. Tiny Dancer. Look, kid. You're already a hero. The only one left to convince is yourself. Come on. Let's get the hell out of here. Are you okay? I'm sorry. I messed up. Mm. It's okay. Why don't you, uh, why don't you get inside? Tiny dancer. It's good to see you too, Bruce. So, how'd you like that daring rescue in the nick of time? You fishing for a compliment, Tony? Meet me on the command deck, all right? We have a short window to make our next move while AIM's still on the back foot. Right, right. Pleasantries later. Got it. Greetings from the anthill. Natasha, thanks for helping save the day back at AIM's prison. And for everything you did as Tiny Dancer. I wonder who our mysterious guardian angel was. Anytime, Hank. Sometimes dirty hands do the best work. True. And how the hell did you folks get the Chimera online, let alone airborne, without Terrigen? The Chimera has the same standard engines as older helicarriers. She's kind of like a hybrid car. But, you know, cool. Something tells me this isn't just a thank you call, Doctor. Guilty as charged. We did a little digging in the data you sent me from the prison. AIM was able to successfully transport most of the Inhumans. I've tracked the ship, but we'll need someone to go in after it. We'll do whatever we can. Thanks. I've already uploaded some mission details to your war table. Pam out. Well, this should be interesting. These two haven't spoken since the hearings. Think Bruce is up to it? He better be. Once we break up Tarleton's little party, he'll clean house. The AIM experience. So many better names. Look, we need the location of that lab. Hundreds of Inhumans depend on it. So Tiny Dancer, huh? Let me guess, you would have gone with Rocket Man. Please, not even close. You're my candle in the wind. Show's about to start. Let me guess. You're planning a big reveal at the Adaptoid launch. The triumphant return of the Avengers. Imprisonment and torture. That's how AIM's gonna make the world a better place. Please. Ebola, smallpox, Polio, all fatal, if not for lab rats. And humans aren't sick, Monica. You're just harvesting their powers to make your little robots. <laughs> robots that possess complex AI. Capable of assessing the most effective application of their powers, all with minimal human casualty. Where's the lab, Monica? You can reverse engineer Terrigen, sure, but it'll be catastrophic and you know it. You were there on A-Day, and you know if we do it again, it's not gonna just endanger in humans, it's gonna endanger all of us. Last I checked, A-Day was your mess. <sighs> Damn it. Gonna need a stronger table. I see some things haven't changed.
Everything's just an experiment with you, isn't it? It is. Tarleton and humans. Me. Scour the Earth. You will not find our lab. The Adaptoids will launch, Bruce. Saving the world requires sacrifice! I'm going in. We need to find that lab. Jarvis? Sensors detect aim forces incoming. Tarleton's come for his sidekick. Nat, Quinjet. You read my mind. Stay with me. All right. Hey, uh, just... Watch yourself up there. I will if you will. Mala, let's go. Be right there. Jarvis, drop the cannon. Tarleton's gotta be heading your way soon. Make your way to the control room, kid. Punch anything that gets near those energy cores. You got it. Miss Han, they just breached the control room. I'm on my way. Please do hurry. isn't home anymore, Kamala. This ends now! Guys? I got a problem here. Guys! So did I. Jarvis! Are you okay? I believe so, Miss Khan. Thank you. But I'm afraid Dr. Rappuccini has escaped. In trouble, Kamala! I need you on the deck now! I'm coming! She's escaping. We're here live at the AIM experience in Manhattan, witnessing the return of the Avengers, but they, they appear to be attacking the city. Keep rolling, keep rolling. Is it any coincidence that this attack comes on the very day that AIM is supposed to unveil their promising new adaptoid program? Oh, shit. Oh. You're welcome. Thank you. You should know. Not in the best of moves! Stay behind me! 
Completely lost your senses. Ah, prodigal son returns. You almost obliterated all of Manhattan. Whoa, holier than thou. Where were you while the world went to hell? Coming to terms with my failings, not making new ones. All right, all right, all right, all right, all right. Everyone just take a breath. We planned on interrupting the AIM experience, showing the world what Tarleton was up to. These are taftoids of his? They harvest their powers through the torture of these inhumans. They expose them to near lethal amounts of dark terrigen. And that is only step one. Georgie Boy is gearing up for a war. And what's worse is, Kamala here has found some evidence that might show what really happened to Steve. Hi. Every hero has to start somewhere. You remember me? Aye. Show me this footage. Jarvis? You... Are you done? I have broken the encryption, so there is more to see. George! We have to shut down the reactor! It's pulling us towards that heat signature! Uh, I've tried, but there's no way to disengage the crystal! Then get out! And seal the door. What? George, go. No. This can't be right. Head to the command deck. What? Evacuate now. No, 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 Cap. What are you doing? No, 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 no. <sighs> Just stop. What are you doing? Smash the reactor. He had to have a reason. What reason? Hundreds of people were infected. People died. Nat, Just take it easy. Did you take some responsibility, Tony? Well, there's the Bruce I know. Throw everyone under the bus, why don't you? No, it's not the time. No, it's okay, Nat. See, he's been waiting to do this since Golden Acres, haven't you? Haven't you? This is our fault. All of ours. How do you not get that? What I get is that you actually believe all that crap you said at the hearing. I believe that we are dangerous. You really think the world is better without us? Yes. I'm out of here. You all have not changed. Look at her. She can't be fixed. She can't be cured. I've done the experiments. I've checked their DNA over and over and over again. You and I created the perfect disease. No, actually, I do the job. I make the tough decisions. Do it. I stand by the people who made me who I am. I am warning you. <laughs> Bruce? Make you angry? <laughs> See, it's always been your problem. Run from who you are, what you are. Maybe that's why. Monica got the better of you. I was just agreeing with you, big guy. That banner is a coward. I don't do this. This is exactly what Tarleton wants. I'd stay out of this one, kid. keep this thing in the air? For quite some time, yes. Oh, that's a relief. <sighs> okay. Interrogation footage. There's gotta be a clue here somewhere. Let me guess. 
You're planning a big reveal at the Adaptoid launch. Come on, Monica, give me something. <laughs> Scour the Earth. You will not find our lab. The Adaptoids will launch, Bruce. Saving the world requires sacrifice. Ugh, this is useless. I just want to talk to my dad. Calling Yusuf Khan. N no, no, don't, Jarvis. I didn't mean to. Hello? Hey, Dad, is that you? Oh, oh come on. Uh, if you're there, I miss you so much. Look, I'm not angry. I just want you to come home. I'm sorry. I should never have told you to hide your powers. Perhaps you're scared, a little unsure. The important thing is that you always stay true to yourself. I love you, Beta. I love you more. will launch <laughs> scour the earth you will not find our lab scour the earth you will not find our lab scour the earth you will not scour the earth scour the earth that's it of course the satellite the satellite Avengers, if you can hear me, I think I found a clue. Look, I know I messed up. I wanted to blame AIM so bad for what happened to me on A-Day, it blinded me. But Cap must have had a good reason for what he did. I, I know it. People believe in the Avengers, not just because of your cool powers, but, but because no matter how bad things get, no matter how much you disagree, you always come together. Don't you get it? Your differences are your greatest superpower. I was just... Some weird kid from Jersey who didn't fit in. But you saw me for who I really was. You accepted me. There's still a bad guy out there who wants to hurt the world. But we can stop him. Good isn't a thing you are. It's a thing you do. shouldn't have said I get it altitude dry eyes look I'm uh, not very good at I'm sorry so same good enough yeah. so you uh Found a clue? Yeah, it's the interview. Listen. Scour the earth. You will not find our lab. Okay. 
Monica's right. The lab's not on Earth. I'm not following. Okay, when I was captured, Monica and Tarleton had this argument. Tarleton had to leave the room, and then Monica pulled up the coordinates to this satellite called Ambrosia. Ambrosia? That was a S.H.I.E.L.D. biomedical research project. AIM must have required it during the takeover. It would be a great place to hide proof of inhuman experiments, right? If you wanted to study in humans on the cellular level, then zero gravity would be a perfect place to do it. Good job. Hey, Tom. Please tell me this is a social call. Yeah, it is. Uh, I'd like to socialize with a few of your pin particles. Need to shrink down an accelerator. <sighs> well, then you'll need to break into a high security aim facility. Ever heard of Meridian? You're gonna have a hard time getting in. That place is no joke. You know, I gotta say, you give a hell of a speech when you're pissed at us. <sighs> Look, Matt, uh, we were idiots. I'm... As much as I love your squirming, it sounds like we've got work to do. I can get us to Meridian. Us? We're in this together, right? No time to lose. My time undercover inside AIM, I never could get the clearance to see Meridian. Well, Nat, you're about to get your chance. Uploading the coordinates to the hypercircuit station entrance. Let's move out. a massive teleport signature. Ah, damn it! Hank, evacuate the Ed Hill now. I don't think so. Hank, that doesn't look ready. Come on, Tony, live a little. Unbelievable. It worked. Congratulations, Dr. Pym. The Resistance has an impressive new weapon. It's sort of cute when they're small. Thanks, guys. I owe you one. Here are the particles Dr. Pym promised. Good luck, Iron Man. Thanks. I'm, uh, gonna need it. What exactly is this Starboost thing? Meet me in the tech lab, kid, and see for yourself. Every test I did before ended badly. But with this new miniaturized accelerator, I have a shot. 